Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Kiara, and today I'm going to be sharing a tennis and golf active wear haul. Some of you may already know from my Instagram posts that I moved down to Florida for the remainder of the year. If you're familiar with Florida, tennis and golf are a huge part of the lifestyle out here, and I do play tennis more so when I'm here, and I dabble in golf. So I've definitely started to pick up golf once more and I'm really excited about my little shopping haul because I totally needed some new golf attire and some new tennis outfits. Just about everything I found today, I think that you could probably wear to both golf and tennis, just depending on some of the hemline lengths for the skirts. Just about all the pieces come from Dick's Sporting Goods. This is one of the first times that I've actually gone in store to purchase clothing. Um, I typically order a lot of stuff online, but this morning I went into Dick's Sporting Goods and tried on some stuff and came back with a lot more than I anticipated. All right, I'm gonna start with the golf finds because I found that really cute proper fitting golf clothes have been very difficult for me, so I wanna share that with you right away. First thing up are these pants from Lady Hagen. I'm kinda of new to the golfing brand, so I might not have heard of all of them, but I think everything in terms of like proper golf wear I got from Lady Hagen. I found that this brand fit me really well in their size extra small. What I really loved about these pants were the fit. They're not too tight like a legging. They're kind of like a slim straight leg is the best way I can describe it and they are higher waisted. Having this easy shaper is like what they branded it or called it and has this power mesh panel that secretly targets the tummy for a smooth appearance and I'm just like, can we put these in all my pants? Because I kind of want this technology in all of my pants. Yeah, the fit, I didn't feel like there was anything drastic holding me in to where like I couldn't play or couldn't move. Like it felt like a very subtle, but like definitely held me in. It was a great length for me. I'm five, six. It has all like the little pockets. I think it's a really elegant, classy pant. Golf is a classier sport. So it's definitely more of that aesthetic. I liked the gray. I think they come in white and black. Those, those are the only colors I, I saw that I can remember. It might come in more colors, I don't know. I did try the white ones on as well, but I found that they were kind of see-through. So I went with the gray version. I'm really happy with the choice so far because I think I'll be able to wear this more this season, like in the fall winter season. All right, my next golf pick is also from Lady Hagen. Like I said, I think all my picks are from Lady Hagen. To match the gray golf pants, I grabbed this like what's it called, like a little half zip or quarter zip, long sleeve. It's just a very, very soft material. I wouldn't say it's so thick that it's a sweater, but it's like a thicker long sleeve. I, I grabbed it because it matches the pants and Dix was having a buy one, get one free with the Lady Hagen pieces. And I thought that was the perfect excuse to get a full matching golf set for the price of just the pants. So to give you an example of the pricing, this zip up was 50 and the pants were 65. So I, you know, paid for the pants and I got the zip up for free, which I think it was such a great deal. I hope Dix continues these, uh, these deals. My third golf piece are these navy shorts. The shorts are a little bit longer and the rise is a lower rise. I typically like high rise pants and shorts, but I really liked the classic style of these navy blue shorts. The material is different. It's like a really lovely, it's not an athletic material. It's almost like an, a very elegant athletic material if it is. And the shorts were actually on major clearance. They were from $50 I paid two dollars for them i i don't know if that was a mistake but the cashier was like yeah they're on clearance they're like a really really high percentage off they fit perfectly they're chic i can wear them playing golf but i can also style them and wear them as like a elegant casual afternoon kind of outfit moving on to the tennis pieces this skirt is by prince i actually had a prince racket when i was first starting to play tennis um so i love this brand big nostalgia for me this skirt is so soft if you could feel this material it's it's so nice i don't want to wipe my makeup off but it's so nice and i really gravitated towards the skirt because it was a nice gray color that i love the neutrals but mainly the length is not too short i found a lot of the tennis skirts could be like really mini 
and this one is I think just the right length. I feel like this skirt can definitely cross over and be a tennis skirt and a golf skirt. So you could probably wear this maybe to lessons, to the driving range, maybe to play a game, I guess depending on like how, how long or short the skirt fits on you specifically, you'd have to make that call for yourself. But 100% for tennis, like I said, the material is so soft. I love this bigger waistband because I do love high-waisted bands that kind of just like hold my waist in, but isn't too tight so that you can still move around and be athletic in. I just appreciate it. This next skirt, I actually had to order online on Nike because Dix did not have it. And I wanted to add it to this haul because I think it's just so special and Nike is really killing it with the tennis skirts, by the way. This is the slit kind of skirt. So underneath here, you have some shorts, high-waisted, really lovely, minimal, kind of tennis skirt. I love the look of it. My only thing is that the shorts are just a little, just a little bit see-through. You have to wear the right fleshy skin tone underwear. I think the skirt is so pretty, so minimal. Very, it's kind of like a fashion skirt. The next piece I got is for when it gets a little bit chillier out here and you can't go around in like just a t-shirt and your mini skirt for tennis or golf. I got the Nike Therma. It's a very, very light, long sleeve, like half a zip thermal. And it says that, you know, it helps manage your body heat in like whatever climate when it's colder. You know, I really went for the aesthetic on this one more than the actual need when I'm in Florida. But I know that when I go back to Houston or when I go up north, I will have just like this beautiful piece to wear in like kind of any situation. It's so chic, so lovely. I think it goes with a lot. When you're just really active outside, you wanna have lightweight layers that keep you warm. And this is just such a beautiful option. This shirt is a must have because it transcends so many different active scenarios you might be in. Tennis, golf, going to the gym, running, walking, biking, so you guys get the point. It's a great classic basic t-shirt that's a dry fit material. The fit is really great, not too tight, not too loose, and it has odor resistant technology, which is always a plus. And the last little guy on my active wear haul are these adorable shorts, a running walking short, or they could be a short underneath um, like a pleated tennis skirt or something. I found them at Walmart for like $11. I think they'll go great with my longer sleeve Nike piece that I just showed you. I really like the length of these shorts. They fit really nicely down the thigh and are not too tight. And my only complaint was that I couldn't find the matching top to them because they are so cute. I would have loved to have the little matching set. I'm sure they're somewhere out there. All right, guys, that brings us to the end of my haul. I hope this was helpful for you. I hope you found some pieces that you liked and that you needed. Maybe this inspires. Thanks for tuning in today. I hope you guys found some pieces that you love. Whether you play tennis and golf or just live an active lifestyle, I hope you found something that you needed and this video was helpful for you. You can stay updated with me every day over on my Instagram. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, you can subscribe over here or over here. I'm not really sure where it is <laughs> until I edit. Feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. Let me know what you want to see next. And as usual, you will find the links to each piece in the description box below.